So I have probably a bunch of people that are wondering why I wanted to start YouTube. Well, here's why. I've always dreamed of being a content creator. I've always been, dreamed of being a YouTuber. I thought it was really cool. I thought it'd be something different. And I like to have different things in my life than sit there and do the same thing over and over because after a while it gets overwhelming and it gets boring. And I also have a lot of friends and family that sit there and say, you should be something. You should be like a YouTuber or something. You're very inspirational. You're an inspirational person. You're very up there. You're a very good person. Well, I thought I would try it. So here's day one of me sitting here talking about why I wanted to start YouTube, what goes on in my life. and. Wait for many more. Just make sure you subscribe with the notification bell on so you get my goofy ass on your damn notification. I mean, shit. And a, there's a lot of controversy that goes on in this world. I don't care about it. I don't care about politics. I don't care about racism. I leave that in the past. I don't care. Like, I like Trump. I admit, I like Trump 100%. What has he ever done to hurt me or put me in a harmful way? That's all I got to say about him. I don't really care about anything else. And the racism stuff, everybody lets it get to them. I don't let it get to them. They could call me racist. Call me what you want. You got to get to know the person before you sit there and hate on somebody. Like, I just let that, I just brush it off off my shoulder. Because I don't care. I don't care about what other people have to say about me. I don't care about, oh, you hurt my feelings. I ain't even got feelings to hurt anymore because... They're just gone. I've never had feelings to sit there and literally take hate from people. I just, I do my own thing. I live life. I try to make my life better the best I can, one piece at a time. That's the best thing you can do in life. You can sit here and put up a camera like me. Do the same thing. Whatever floats your boat, you'll build slowly but surely. It takes time and effort if you want to do something in life. Like this, for example. YouTube, you can't just hop on, make a video, and expect to get millions and millions of subscribers. It doesn't work that way. It takes time, and it takes effort. You gotta wanna take the time to put the effort in. Like, for example, I have a lot of people that hate on me on Snapchat, Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook. Those people all hate on me. But at the end of the day, I look at them like a bunch of clowns because they really are. You're hating on somebody that's doing better in their life than you are. That's the way I look at it. I look at a lot of YouTubers as big inspirations like Arta Kicks, Dylan Talks, Upchurch, because Upchurch also does music and I just, I like his vibe. His vibe's just amazing. So is Arta Kicks. Arta Kicks is a very big reaction channel that pops really big and just a good, just good people. and. I love the motivation they have. I love the positivity they have. And there's one thing I have to say. A lot of these kids nowadays, you may be one of them, live way too much on social media. Look up from your phone screen and see what the real world is. Because the more you keep looking at your phone screen is the more you're not gonna be anything. I ain't trying to meet that towards disrespect or being rude. But what I'm saying is, there's a whole nother world outside your TV or phone screen. You gotta wanna sit there and put the phone down like me. Put it in my pocket, I go have fun in the real world. I'm 17 years old. I like to play in the dirt, I admit it. I don't care what other people have to sit there and say about me. Because I don't let it get to me. And I don't let somebody hate on me unless, unless they know me. Now, if you know me and you're gonna hate on me, that's your, that's your opinion, that's your perspective. I don't care hate on me and everybody has to say something about somebody nowadays and what i really don't understand is why hate on somebody why talk crap about somebody when you're not even doing well in your life yourself sit there and make yourself a better person before you talk crap about somebody else i don't like any crap talkers i will stand up for any bully in this world like for example I was in middle school, I got suspended because I tried to stick up for the autis autistic kids that had problems and they couldn't help it. That's their disorder and you, you really can't help that. That's their problem and people made fun of them and I really don't like it. I would go over to their classroom, I would give them high fives, I would hang out and talk to them because they never really had friends like 
the other normal people did. And I don't consider everybody normal. Everybody has their own problems. Everybody sits there and struggles with their own problems in their life. Nobody's perfect whatsoever. And that's what a lot of problems are in this life. In this world as well. People think everybody literally is perfect. Like, you can sit there and try to be perfect. You're not going to be perfect. You can sit there and try to be perfect from head to toe. And as you can tell, I'm all over the place with this. Well, I just like to get into it and tell everybody about themselves. I don't care. Opinions and hatred don't don't hurt me at all. I have no feelings to hurt. That flag is a family heritage, and if you're going to hate on it, you can click off this video and find another video that's more interesting. I don't care. But what I'm saying is, don't sit there and let somebody hate on you for what you do or what you wear or what you say. Be you, because being you at the end of the day is all that matters. That's literally all that matters in this world. Being you is probably bet the one of the best things you can do in this world nowadays. Because if you don't be you, then you're just gonna sit there and be unhappy with yourself. You're gonna sit there and, oh man, I wish I was that person. Don't wish you were someone else. Just be yourself. Comment down below if you want me to do any challenges. I will gladly do them. Comment down below any vlogs or videos you want to see. Without further ado, I'm going to be out this thing. Like, comment, subscribe. Make sure to turn that bell on. Because if you don't turn that bell on, you ain't going to miss. You ain't going to see any goofy ass videos of me. Just saying. Stay classy.